The people who invented the igloo were truly brilliant. Inside an igloo, the air can warm to about 16 degrees Celsius, around 60 degrees Fahrenheit, with only people's body heat, even when it is far below freezing outside. But here's the puzzle. Snow and ice are cold, so why would anyone use them to build a house? The answer lies in the structure of snow. The snow used for igloos is wind-packed, so it can be cut into blocks, not loose, fluffy powder. It is compacted enough to hold shape, yet still filled with trapped air. Those air pockets act as natural insulation, which is why snow, unlike solid ice, can retain heat. If the snow is made too dense, heat conducts more readily and insulation declines, so builders seek firm but still airy blocks. The heat released by the human body is retained by the insulating snow walls, slowing heat loss and allowing the interior to warm. On top of that, the igloo's dome shape is brilliantly designed. It helps block wind and limit heat loss, which keeps the interior temperature more stable. Add in the natural behavior of air. Cold air sinks while warm air rises, so builders often raise sleeping platforms to stay within the warmer layer of air. In one of the coldest places on Earth, the igloo is a remarkable example of human ingenuity.